Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Tashina and if you're new to my channel, um, I would suggest you subscribe, like and share this video because I don't know if you know girl, but I bring you affordable hair on a budget. So I would highly suggest you, su you subscribe to my channel. Um, I've started this affordable wig series where I bring you affordable wigs um, on the low. So far I've been able to get wigs to be under $20, um, even some $6 that is nice and look really, really well. Um, so if you haven't, I would highly suggest you check out my other affordable videos. Um, they are linked in a playlist. So. And you, and I'm pretty sure you'll find something in there that you like. There's a lot of videos um, and a lot of hair I have to come. So subscribe and come back around and stick with my channel. Um, about this unit on my hair though, it's quite shocking. So let's jump right in and uh, talk about who she is. So this is by the company Royal. And it's their Swiss Lace Pre-Tweeze Part. It has it's a C part shape, Rebby Fiber, Sombre, um, and it's their deep and wide pre-tweeze. Okay, soft and natural, I've said that before. Um, the style is SWH NYX, and the color is SOMRT Purple Blast. Now, this is what the stock card looks like. Um, this company, I've never heard of them before, but I will be purchasing from them again. Um, this here is, I don't know what to say about it. So, when I got it, um, when I looked, when I first saw this here on the website, and if you're wondering, and if you're new to my channel, but if you're oldie or a goodie, you all know that I purchased my wigs from wigtypes.com, and that's because, once again, I live where... New York and shipping is affordable and I get my stuff pretty quick actually I just did I just say shipping in New York is affordable because shipping in New York is not affordable that is such a lie everyone who lives in New York know that is expensive so expensive uh, it's not cheap to ship in New York but I get my stuff a lot easier um, this here when I went on the website to purchase it, I saw that they had like these unusual color and the girl obviously was wearing the, um, what's this called? Purple Blast. I'm like, I don't know about that purple color, but I'm going to try it. So when I got it and I took it out of the pack, I was like, a bit scared. It's like my whole, this flash before my eyes like I was like you are gonna look like what's that cartoon correct character um that's big and purple is that Barney yes I thought it was gonna look like Barney <clears throat> I was like no way in hell I'm gonna wear that unit mm -mm. it has nice curls to it and everything but no I'm not wearing it I tried it on I'm like oh okay it's not that bad the pattern is pretty good I'm like can work with this it will it will it will be okay so um, I'm glad I purchased the color it's different for me but I do like it I don't know where the hell I'm gonna wear this unit to because it's purple so it's the one time I'm like I cannot go on camera and tell these people that I'm gonna wear this unit to the supermarket like everyone's gonna be like you are fucking Yeah, so no. I don't know where I'm going to wear this unit to, but it's a beautiful unit. Maybe on vacation um, to a tropical island or something and uh, where people are not <laughs> but they're probably going to still be shocked about where the heck I am going with this unit. Now, one thing I like about this unit is that it has dark roots and then it's the purple comes in. So it's not that bold and dramatic. It is still dramatic, but you can rock it because it has dark roots. So it's not going to be like a wiggy, wiggy type look. The texture of this hair is yakky. It's thick. 
um, it has a nice little bounce to it. It does tangle and I would suggest have a powder brush on hand to put those curls back in formation. Um, I think it's big head friendly because it's huge. Actually, I don't think, I know it's big head friendly because my head is pretty big and this unit is pretty loose on my head and I have a good size head. So yeah, um, the combs in this unit, there's two by the part in space right here and one in the back. Um, it is nice. I like it. The, I like the curls. I like the texture. It has a, yeah, that like natural hair blown out put some curls in it that yakky nice texture that's what it has um, and I like it it's very very nice um, again I don't know I will purchase this here again but I think I'm gonna go for something a little bit more subtle subtle um, this is what the pardon space look like I did I, I didn't really pluck anything out of it that much. I just kind of make it a little bit more defined. And I put some powder into it and made the parting pop up a little bit more. I think it looks nice. I think it looks a, a less wiggy. Um, again, this wig I did purchase from wigtypes.com. I will leave the link for this unit in the description box. Um, yeah, let me know what you think about NYX. Oh my god, this hair. I don't know. Um, so I'll show you what the hair looks like from each side. So this is what it looks like from the front, obviously. And this is what it looks like from the side. And this is what it looks like from the other side. And this is what it looks like from the back, with all the hair at the back. Now, if you already have this unit or you're thinking about purchasing this unit, um, let me know. Let me know what color you actually have gotten or are going to get. And let me know if you think of this style. If you, do you think it looks good on me? Do you like it? Do you not like it? Um, I'm always curious to find out. I like this little soup right here. I think it looks good. If I had this in, like, in a 1B or a number 2... I think it would look like I got bundle hair put in. I mean, it doesn't look like I didn't get a nice unit put on, but it's just the color of it. And I don't know if it, it's coming up really shiny on camera, but it's actually not that bad in person. It's not shiny at all. It's quite muted out. I, I really, really like it. Um, again, um, my name is Tashina, and thank you for sticking to the end of this video. Um, and if you haven't yet, please like, please leave me a comment. I like to talk to you guys. Share this video with your friends and family. And once again, subscribe. I'm going to be bringing you a lot of good stuff. And I'm just ready to build a community and a family over here. Let's talk. Let's chat. Let me know what you want to see on this channel. And until next time, thank you for stopping by.